words carry endless amounts of value. They seem to tug at our existence and paint our emotions for others to understand. Yet, finding the right words can be a really difficult task. Life is short though. People come and go, and sometimes we miss our chances to say how we feel. The weight of words can't hold us back from speaking our truth, because life is just too temporary to be lived in fear. So it's time, it's time that I tell them to lift the weight upon my back and shed the fear from my heart, to finally say, I love you. How often do I find myself sitting and thinking about all that I hope for? Too often to say. I'll admit I dream about something perfect, only to be disappointed by the reality. And crying doesn't seem to help much, but for now, it seems to be the best that I can do. As long as I've been alive, I've always been content to be alone. To sit and watch the faces of people passing by. But every once in a while, I find myself wishing that I had someone for me too. Someone to share my secrets, to sit in silence with, and to learn alongside. But is my solitude self-made? At times, I've thought it might just take the leap, because if you never ask, then how else will you know? But in the end, fear always wins. How could you leave me to sit and wonder what went wrong? After all that time and energy, I gave you the key to my heart too. And I opened up. Just to have it shattered into two. But maybe, Maybe I did it to myself. I was just too blinded by my own ideals to see the truth. If you ever thought I would allow someone to treat me so badly, you'd be dreadfully wrong. The sun may shine on you now, but your actions deserve the storm that you've caused. So watch as the tide begins to roll in and the clouds start to rush over. And I am finally freed from the gloom that you've created. So enjoy the rain that you asked for and I'll go bask in the sun. One time, my therapist asked me if I had ever wanted to be in love. Despite how often I seem to think about the topic, I know very little. In fact, a PowerPoint on my love life would be one slide long and empty at that. And I can't be the king of love when I don't know anything about it. But I really wish I knew. 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 It's easy to feel gray when you're surrounded by it. But then comes this tiny crack of sunlight and I can feel my heart begin to thaw. I think of beaches and tacos and my worries melt away. Maybe I'll play tennis and drink lemonade while I hang with my family out there in Venice. 
Slowly, but surely, the visions of summer come into view. My heart warms. It's too bad that for the next four months, all I can do is watch summer on the television just to feel a sense of hope. But when the sun comes, I'll go outside and enjoy the fresh air. The thought never crossed my mind that one day you would leave my life. And to be honest, things feel so empty when they aren't in pairs. But I do know that your memory will stick with me forever, even if it's just through simple photographs. You know those people you immediately click with, and sometimes, you don't ever want to imagine what life would be like without them, and they fade away anyways. And you watch them as they go about their life without you. But maybe it's okay, because people come and people go, and you've learned that that's just fine. So you go to bed, you close your eyes and sleep. I can't sleep. The thought of you bounces in my head like a rubber ball. You stick there in my brain like glue. But maybe I'm just lonely and it's too late to know the truth. So I'll lay here restless eyes weary with the thought of you.